Hello everyone, and welcome back to Civilization V of Vox Populi. Let's play as Morocco. And uh, we're keeping an eye on Genghis Khan as he uh, slowly sneaks up on our eastern side here. <clears throat> uh, I'm hoping the combination of the desert and a whole bunch of heavy skirmishers can keep him off while we research chemistry. But um, yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if he declared war on us fairly shortly. But let's keep going. And uh, see where this takes us. Oh, and um, our great channel. Let's bring him a little bit closer to the frontier. And uh, next turn. Yeah, so Genghis Khan is well behind us in tech level, but he does have gunpowder. And uh, that's going to make him dangerous. Especially uh, given his uh, natural aggression. So Catherine is now in the Renaissance, okay. So yeah, uh, we're, we're about two attacks ahead of the leader. Um, so we're doing pretty well in science, even though we haven't really focused on science at all. A and yeah, we're at 73 happiness right now. The Golden Age is helping with that, but uh, we, we've been having killer happiness all the way through. And uh, let's see. So we should be doing well with the Golden Ages. Okay, we just finished the um, temple. What do we want next? Let's go for a, uh... We should start pulling hardest guilds around here, but, um... Not right away. Let's get a bats. And, um... I like to spread it out so that our guilds... We're not doubling up the guilds in different cities. So... Let's go with the garden there so we can get extra usage out of our, um... Specialists. And let's see, uh, our aqueduct. Yeah, ooh, we're definitely overdue for an aqueduct there. And explore. Okay, let's say Genghis backed up a little bit. So maybe he's having second thoughts. Not sure if he can see our troops or not. But uh, let's do an up. What kind of. We have accuracy too on him. Yeah, this might be another good one to replace because it doesn't have a whole lot of experience. Uh, but yeah, uh, we're going to have to, uh, ooh, tea plantation. Haven't even started on that one yet. Should have done that a long time ago. Um, yeah. So, um, given our high production and, uh, the cost of upgrading units, I'm thinking it would be better to upgrade as much as we can. Uh, I mean to replace rather than upgrade, just to save a little bit of money. Uh, okay, we could... Do we want to mine on that hill? Yeah, might as well, I guess. Bring that next turn, and... Okay, and we can put another Casbah on the other side of Casablanca. And uh, that guy is going to... Going to, oh, yeah, that's not a Casbah place. Um, could we hook up the sheep? Maybe we should uh, hook up the sheep there. It's going to be a while before we... Oh, we don't have enough uh, things to buy. Oh, but uh, we can work on the wheat here. Yeah, that guy's just been sitting there since the very start of the game. Okay, and let's move that guy into Fez. And just to uh, give our troops a little bit more strength and... I think everyone else is going to wait on the road here. So, in case uh, Genghis Khan makes his move. And that's it for now. Four more turns till we get chemistry. And I uh, hope we get the Leaning Tower, because that's a really great wonder. Oh, and speaking of buying tiles, oh, we can get that. That's only 180. And we have it. So let's build that academy. That's sort of like a little university town over here. It's got uh, lots of little programmers here learning how to write video games. It's probably a nice place to live. Way on the countryside, just uh, surrounded by a bunch of you know, uh, university kids and intellectuals. You know, epic you know, beer pong parties. Anyhow. So is there anything else around there? I guess they could go visit the castle. That would be 
guess that'd be the big thrill there. And uh, they're right by the silk farm, so uh, maybe that's a good place to earn a little bit of extra money. Uh, okay, who likes Darius? Uh, ooh. Yeah, lots of people don't like Darius, so I think we're going to skip that for now. But um, we'll keep it in mind for later. So we don't want to piss off everyone yet. Okay, and uh, so what's going on? He was telling us. Yeah, he appears to be backing up. So I don't know, maybe he can tell that we uh, moved a whole bunch of troops into the area. He shouldn't, but. Uh, or maybe he's just uh, going to attack China, maybe? I don't know. Uh, so, which worker is that? Choose production. Uh, let's see. Okay, Circus Maximus is done. So, we got all of our national wonders done. Okay, Apostolic Palace. We need 5% more followers. Okay, I guess we should get that reasonably soon. And yeah, when we do that, we start generating golden age points. In the city. So yeah, we're gonna want to build that as soon as we can. But uh, first, uh, an armory, so we can uh, build some decent units in that city too. And worker, and a Casba, and a Casba. And uh, that's gonna be a mine because we're too far away for a Casba. Although, uh, yeah, America should have fantastic production. It already has fantastic production. And uh, next turn. So. Um, no, not selling iron. I don't know, maybe we should have built the. Um, uh, not really the. Uh, oh, what's it called? The one we built in Mechness. The one that gives you the uh, military promotion. Oh, Mechness is a good city for it, too. Over in India, foreign diplomat. Okay. Cahokia is hosting foreign. Okay, yeah, I don't think we're going to be sending any uh, diplomats over there. Pretty far away, too. Event is ended. Reset ended. Okay. Catherine, uh, let's Здравствуй. snitch on a woo, and uh, it should give us a little bit of a bonus here. And let's see, uh, what about coffee? Might be a useful thing to buy. Здравствуй. How much is that going for? Говори. Five. Ten. Twenty. Yeah, that's going for way too much. Surprised she won't sell it because, like, she has several of them. But oh well. Uh, let's see. Um. This might be a good place for a uh, artist guild, except that none of these guys are being worked right now, so maybe our output is... Oh, uh, we could get a harbor. That would make the sea more valuable. Yeah, let's do that. That might give us the uh, boost we need to make that a more uh, growth-friendly city. So let's stay there. Okay, uh, we finished the village there. Where are we going to go next with that guy? Um, this came to the point where it might make more sense to just um, bring that guy over there to just uh, put them on automatic. But uh, for now, we'll still do it manually. Okay, and uh, next turn, one turn to get chemistry. Then we can start working on gunpowder. And I don't know, Genghis Khan has a whole lot of troops over here. Budica, okay. Really? It's like, you're gonna get wiped out. It's like, well, I guess they're still sorry about... I guess I want Dublin back. So it looks like uh, someone struck a Dublin, but uh, this is not going to end well for them. On the plus side, Genghis Khan might be able to get back a lot of those work of the chem Chemistry, okay. And, gonna go, and we are more than overdue for gunpowder, so... Let's get that. And uh, Mechness is going to build. Is this a good place for an artist guild? Um, it has a lot of production, but not a lot of food. 
Yeah, I'm thinking an artist guild might make more place, might, might make more sense in a less industrial city. Uh, let's... Anyhow. Let's go to the grocer so we can get better growth. Oh, well, maybe caravansary first? Okay, let's do the caravansary and then the grocer. Should we rush that? Okay, let's rush that. And okay, choose production. And we've got the baths. Um cure of answer. And let's see, this is the uh let's put a temple up there. And Raiders go. Okay, no. This might be a good place for an artist guild. So let's put one of those in here. Actually, let's do the temple first. And, uh... Actually, we're going to have to start building more trains pretty soon, but, uh... Uh, let's go with a, uh... Barracks. Okay. And stay put. Oh, and adopt a policy. Okay. Now, normally when I'm uh, going through this, I like to take rationalism because not only is this like the hands down best Renaissance era policy in uh, Brave New World, but it also has some neat stuff. The trouble with this one is it only gives you a science boost when you're happy. Now, we've got some incredible happiness going on right now. This, this is exceptional. Uh, but I, I'm worried that we could lose that, and once you lose that, you lose most of the benefit of unlocking this tree. So, one of the things I wanted to do when I started this game was give industry a try just to see how it goes. So, uh, let's give that a shot. That should give us a lot of money and a lot of production. And, um, yeah, some bonuses too. So, let's try this and uh, see what happens. Okay, and, gonna close. And uh, we're getting a ton of culture, so I don't know, we might be able to pick uh, a second branch too. So, caravan. This guy is going to go to. Alright, let's go for highest science. Okay, yeah, the uh, Genghis Khan has the best roots with respect to that, however. We can get 15, 9, and 15 from uh, Valletta, so that's just too good to turn down. Uh, let's see, and how are we doing on tax? So we have 33, Mongolia has 29, so yeah, we're four ahead of Mongolia, but gunpowder is a very significant tax, so uh, we should have that pretty soon, and then we can... Uh, upgrade our, well, rebuild our army, and then uh, take it from there. Yeah, it's a bit risky uh, waiting uh, this long. Maybe we should upgrade that archer. Just so we have a stronger unit nearby. Hmm. I don't usually use a lot of the archer line of units. Uh, let's see. I don't really want the open borders. Uh, I think one of our cities does want that. So, you know, and we have like, you know, we have an extra wine. Does anyone else want wine? Doesn't look like it. So, got four. Six, seven. Well, let's give that a shot. Propose. Shapir. So that's real expensive for uh, lapis lazuli, but one of our cities wants it. So Marrakesh wants it, so that could be uh, very valuable. Okay. okay. So maybe we should. Oh, but this should be really nice. This. This is a problem here. You get. So caught up building buildings, you completely forget your military. Let's no. 
Terry goes are going to be pretty soon. Let's get a grocer. Uh, because growth in our capital will be really helpful. And let's see. Uh, explore. Okay, that guy is going to prepare that. That guy is going to stay there. I think we have enough troops to defend the foes while we wait for more production. And let's see, you these orders. Worker. Um, okay, lots of Casbos around where that. Yeah, that, that is some fantastic production there. Uh, let's bring that guy. Yeah, let's put a village on uh, that road there. That'd be a good spot for a village. And okay, next turn. So, oh, no, we should be building uh, the Leaning Tower in Marrakesh. Okay, well, after the grocer. Spend all that time trying to get chemistry, and then we completely forget about the wonder. Uh, nope, because that'll get me into a war with Genghis Khan pretty quick. And I'm going to do that, but I want to do it on my own terms. It's a little bit too soon to do it now. And there's still a whole lot of... they're sneaking around. How's things going over here? Edinburgh and Cardiff. Yeah, they backed off Dublin. So uh, we'll see how that turns out. Oh, we got another great talk. Great. Uh, let's see. Alright. Back. Let's uh, queue up Green Tower just so we don't forget. Again. And choose production. Okay, we are going to produce... Actually, how many turns? Six turns for gunpowder, so... We can get in six turns. We can get... No, we don't really need that. We can get a chancery. Hmm. We're not going to be using civil servants, but, well, three maintenance. And two production for every ally. How many allies do we have? In city states. We actually have quite a few, so maybe that does make sense. Let's get a chance right now here. Okay, now where are we going to put this holy site? Put it in the desert. Uh, or it probably makes more sense up north here. We can put... Oh, that's a little bit close to Russia. We could put it over here no, near Sofia. That might be good. Okay, yeah, let's try that. Okay, and let's see... Alright, next turn. Mm -hmm. That might be useful too, although that's... I don't think we're going to need to defend too much, and cities that are exposed have reasonable defense as it is. We've got the, the walls in the castle that gives you... Well, we're, at, we're at 60 right now in Fez, so I think that should be enough, given all the other troops that are there, too. Okay, India and Russia are friends. Zurich longs for culture. Okay, Golden Age is about to end. Okay, and... Oh, we're still at 69 happiness. That's really good. And the production in Fez is going to be... Um... Get a... Grocer. To finish this one up. And I'm gonna pause there. She's production. Um... Oh, yeah, let's finish that Casbah. Don't think we quite finished that one. And gonna choose for production. Okay, we finished the harbor over here. Um, yeah, unfortunately, we still only have that one fish. 
But uh, we can also build a what? Do want a temple? Uh, actually, we're at the point of that was to uh, make the artist guild more appealing. Yeah, or maybe we should get the grocer first. Just to uh, boost um, population over here. Because I would like to put a guild over there, but I also want to have the population work it. And let's go for an armory. Okay, should be good. And... Okay, next turn. Then powder in five. Okay, and let's, uh, oh, we don't have enough land to get the land there. Uh, I guess we could wait another turn, or do we want to build on top of the forest? Or what about the desert here? How much is that? Yeah, let's just wait another turn. Or, yeah, we're thinking of that place, but that's a little bit close to Russia. Let's wait one more turn so we can get the land by the land. And, uh, next turn. Wittenberg. Oop, okay. Oh, they are way over there, I think. Uh, no, no open borders. Okay, oh, uh, they have the truffle monopoly again. I guess I lost that for a little bit. And we're still waiting. Oh, Mongolia and China, good. So there's a whole bunch of people fighting Mongolia right now. So that should take the pressure back off of us and make an invasion all the easier. But uh, yeah, we need to stop uh, building infrastructure and start producing an army. And we'll do that as soon as we get the camera out of Okay, and you will stay where you are. And choose production. Where? Temple. Um. Uh, what do I want here? Caravansary? Sure. And. Alright. Okay, choose production. Um. Caravansary. We are at the Raiders' Guild, so let's build a uh, circus, I guess. Sure. Great profit. Okay, let's buy that land. Uh, okay. 225. Alright. That guy is going to come up here and build a holy site. Okay, and yeah, that's a good-looking holy site up there. Okay, next turn. So let's see how this... I, I'm going to guess that there's not going to be a whole lot of progress made here, but... Um, oh, they're uh, taking out the pikemen over there. Yeah, that's not going to fare well against uh, Tarico. Or Tertio. Nope. Maybe we should uh, move that guy up a little bit so we can uh, get a better view of the action. So yeah, that's one of the nice thing about keeping your uh, Pathfinder around and just promoting him. You can get a really good view of uh, what's going on. So it's so nice to have that uh, huge view range later on in the game. Uh, okay, we are... Oh, we're uh, 15 social policies ahead of everyone else. Good. And, yeah, Genghis Khan's... Darius is way back. So is Gudica. But they've had trouble growing with uh, uh, being harassed by, uh, I guess, India on the one side and the Mongols over here. So let's keep that guy over there so we can keep an eye on what's going on. And, all right, we finished there. What is this guy going to do? Uh, we should probably build that pasture up there. 
And let's see, okay, the T is improved. Let's build a Casbah. Yep. Oh, and we got a Samurai. That'll be useful. Um, hmm. An extra shot, let's get the uh, coverage. Okay. So, yeah, we don't get a special promotion that uh, you get if you're playing as Japan. But Samurai would still be uh, a nice, it's definitely a nice military unit. And we can upgrade him too. So we have the temple there, let's... Hmm. Okay, Caravansary. Because we don't want to spend too long building stuff. Because we almost have gunpowder. And choose production. So that is done. Um, Want a chancery down here? So, uh, let's try on the grocer. We don't have to finish the grocer, but we're gonna need one eventually. So next turn. What's going on over here? Okay, yeah. Well, China is uh, being pushed back, but I'm pretty sure they'll have a lot of troops up here. So they can uh, turn around and uh, go back in the other direction. I I wouldn't expect Nanjing to fall, but um, you never know. Uh, Mongolia does have a very powerful army, and yeah, that that's a lot of um, Tur Turkio Tertio. <laughs> okay, uh, close. Okay, World Congress founded. And do we get to pick something? Click to propose. Okay, now, Cassus Belly, Natural Heritage Sites. Um, that might be nice, especially if we, uh, we already have Lake Victoria and we could capture a couple from uh, Mongolia. Um, treasure Fleet, we have really good production, so that might work. Uh, but the thing is, we don't have access to the ocean, so this mostly helps with your navy. Um, so, wouldn't be that useful. I think I will go with natural heritage sites, because I think long term that's going to help us. Commit proposal. Uh, actually, let me just double check. Yeah, natural wonder plus two dollar yields. Commit proposal. Yes. Okay, unit needs orders. Uh, let's see, that guy is going to put a village over here. Yeah, I think that'll be useful. And let's build Kazba over there. And let's bring this samurai down over here. And we can... Hmm, we don't have any defenses up there right now. Maybe we can uh, send them into the city and to just stay there. Be a special samurai guard for that one city on our northeast border. Okay, and all right, Chichen Itza in three turns. Keep your fingers crossed. And next turn. Oh, leaning tower in six. So, uh, I think we'll get the wonders, but you never know until they're built. See, I've had a lot of wonders stolen with a one turn to go. I think the AI probably pays attention to that and then just rushes or has, spends a great engineer when you're about to finish your wonder, just to, just to make you really angry. Oh well. <laughs> So, come on, Gang's Gun, what's going to happen? So, they're fighting... Oh, and their Edinburgh is taking damage. So, these guys got a really big army. So, we are going to have to really push once we get the gunpowder. And the unit needs orders. Uh, okay, let's build a pasture. And... Okay, next turn... And uh, I've got 
got some troops around old Sari. I guess they're just healing up. Because, um, nope. I'm guessing uh, China was able to bombard them so they can back up over there. Uh, how much silk do we have? I think that should be fine because we have plenty of silk. And I'll make them like us a little bit more. So, oh wait a second, no we don't, it's, it's wine we have a lot of, not silk. Oh well. It's not that much. Like, we're making 213 per turn right now. And, uh, yeah, especially with our social policies, 13 turns to the next social policy. So we're really turning through that tree as well. And I'm going to close. And... Can't be next turn already. Is it? Okay, anyway, I think I'm going to cut it there. But uh, thanks for following me this far. And, um... Hope you enjoyed it and join me again for the next episode of Let's Play Civilization 5.